big dude, so we've had our battles. I'm enjoying it. He gets me better. I get him better, so I'm sure we'll still be doing it in two years from now. <laughs> what are you going to work on most between now and, and the start of training camp in July? What's your focus going to be? Definitely learn the playbook and get with the vets, learn all the terminology and making sure I mesh well and I can communicate on the same level as them. What's been the biggest adjustment for you so far? I would say definitely the speed. The NFL is go, 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 go. You know, in college you can take a couple plays off. You can't, you know, catch your breath, but you're going against all pros every day, so you can't take any reps off at all. Who's been some of the toughest guys you've gone against here in the first couple of days? Definitely the entire offensive line. <laughs> I've got a, they got a little piece of me every play. I think I've lined up as a three, zero, shade, two eye. So I've lined up against every guard and center here. So I've been having fun with it. How multiple were you in college, or was it basically this is this is your position, just do it time and time again? Uh, I was. Depends on what front we were in. If we were in a three down or a four down. For four down, I can play three tech nose, a shade. When we're in a three down, I'm just ahead of two gap guy. It doesn't matter to me. Whatever front they call, I'll get more comfortable in. It's a pretty young D tackle room here. Just a lot of guys have been drafted in the last couple of years. Have you talked to Oso, Neville, or any of those guys as much at this point? No, I haven't talked to any of the vets yet, but I'm sure Monday when we introduce each other and everything, we'll start to connect and communicate and become a unit. Making the jump to this level, do you feel it's more – more strength and more physical for you, or is it going to be about the technique and that's going to kind of... Um, it's mostly technique and condition. Because, I mean, you got guys that are 30 years old playing. I guarantee they're not as strong as they were when they are 23. So it's mostly just techniques and condition. If you can condition and you can't lose your technique, then everything else will pan out for you. Did they give you a weight yet that they want you to come out? No. I'm about 320 right now, 318, so... I'm sure it's I'll be. Optimum. Yeah, I'm. I'm sure it dropped today, and it's pretty hot today. <laughs> uh, Arkansas, I was like 328, 325. Uh, I haven't talked to the strength and nutrition staff, but I'm sure they'll probably cut me down a couple of pounds and build me back up. You know. <laughs> yeah. So what are you gonna be eating when they build you back up? Uh, it's big, probably some cows in Texas. <laughs> <laughs> we got hogs or something here. Yeah, yeah, probably a couple cows a week or something. <laughs>